some love. Where the other Minnesota footwork is at, man? Oh, they at home. You know, they trying to get their funds together. You know, everybody hard work, real play, really. But everybody trying to get their funds. They'll come to Chicago, show y'all some love. Yeah, as so. One, as a whole, you know? Yeah. So, I've been meaning to tell you how, what's been going on with Minnesota. I mean, you know, it's been a little bit low-key. I haven't heard from no no going off events. I ain't heard nothing from you. You've been so MIA. I seen you a few times. Last time I saw you battle was like 010 at Claremont <laughs> War Zone and shit. <laughs> you know? Oh, well, as far as like me, you know, I'm Black Ghost Entertainment, LTW Black Ghost Entertainment. I started it up in like 06. You know, so I'm taking the, the business approach, you know, business state of mind approach a little better. You know, I'm getting older, so. Far like the four game in Minnesota. It's, 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 like I told you before, it's a lot of girls coming up shortly. You know, they getting into it. Everybody pretty much getting into yeah. it. You know, trying to figure out what area they trying to be in, what team. You know? Yeah. I've been here. I've been here. You know, I saw the interview with uh, YB for Fortune and Bang and something okay. about it's starting to be more and more footwear coming out the reach. But they say the only group that's out is just TOB and Revelation. So what you gotta say on that? Any more groups besides what those two I'm hearing about? So give us a little quick history of how Minnesota Footwork started. I heard it started like some years ago, but I ain't knew about it. Only footwork I knew back then was Indiana, cause you know, their next door neighbors, y'all, two doors neighbors up from Wisconsin all the way to Minnesota, the very top, yeah. so. Shout out to Untouchables out there in Wisconsin too, you know, up there in Milwaukee, doing anything. But as uh, far as my knowledge, you know, Footwork has started, you know, 2000 for me. That's when I started dancing out there with Magic Feet, you know, that's when. Like, it went from like banging, you know, to actually footworking, you know what I'm saying? Boogie brought that actually footworking, you know, combos and everything with Magic Feet, so shout out to Boogies and whatever. So you was one of like the few first people that started footworking in Minnesota? No, like... no, actually I wasn't one of the, no, I came like in the midst of all of that, you know, I was playing basketball, like I told Fortune of Bangs, I was a basketball player, so when I moved here, I got into like track and basketball, you know, I ain't started dancing since the past. Oh, okay, okay. You know, I was just one of the little mystery dancers. You know, everybody wanted to see me. You know, I'm a So everybody just wanted to see me. So I finally came out 2000 with, with Maddie Fee, you know? Okay, okay. So they call you the queen of footwork of Minnesota. So how you feel about that title? You know, you feel like any females try to come, has any female in Minnesota try to come at you since you the top dog and such, you know? Oh, no. Nobody tries to battle me, just the guys. You know? All the guys? Yeah, I, I get a lot of respect, you know, because like I said, I'm a dancer, you know, I'm, a, I'm an artist, you know, that's what I do. I do hip hop, other types of dance styles too. You know, I'm not just not a full worker, so they, they show me a hell of a lot of respect. He's been one of the oldest niggas out there. Now, the queen, that queen shit came from Chicago. Chicago gave me Queen of Minnesota, actually. You know, we wasn't using kings and queens. And so actually we came out here, you know, 2006, 2007. Oh, okay, okay. So it wasn't none of that. It was just give everybody respect, you know, and, and you know when you walk up into the place who is who. <laughs> you ain't got to get no names and nothing. Like, yo, what up? Yeah, you just pay homage, you know, and learn from the best or, you know, whatever you want to do. 
So yeah, you know, how you feel that Minnesota's now the underdog, you know, the newest footwork out of town. You know, Chicago's becoming reckless at y'all and such, you know, but Minnesota ain't going, you know. They trying to be, like, they trying to get the same respect as, you know, we trying to get them respect and such like that. So what you got to speak on that? Because, you know, we play no games in the homeland. Like, you know, one of my mans right here, Brian the Block and such, you know, Indiana foot workers, and then we got Minnesota right here. So, you know, two states coming to the foundation in the homeland, so. Out of the whole Midwest. Underdog. We love it. You know, we think ain't nobody fuck up with us, but we love, we love it. Yeah. Like competition and shit. It ain't, it ain't nothing. Like, we ain't here, like, to be fighting anything. It's just about the damn style. It's about the whole, whatever else. We think that we can come out with a, with a, our own style, and it'll be a better style. So that's, that's what we all about right now. It's okay. making it for ourselves. You know, we ain't trying to be like nobody. You know, we ain't trying to take nobody's swag or anything. We're trying to bring our own style and what we do. So what's y'all future for Minnesota footwork and juke? You know? Oh, 2013, we're gonna have like a thousand kids. Sudden in Chicago and on Walla Cam. <laughs> oh, it's gonna we be coming a- Coming back to Walla Cam again. Yeah, yeah. We came right. to Walla Cam, what was that? Like 2010, 2009 with the hip hop. Yeah. We took second and third, you know? You know, so y'all trying to do a Minnesota takeover in Chicago and such, huh? We're we going to do that with the footwork, and it's, it's only going to be so long, you know. We ain't going to be quiet for long. We know our place. We pick our battles. Oh, y'all not really quiet. I mean, y'all, I'm hearing y'all talking. I'll be watching y'all, you know, because it's, it's, it's going off and now, such. Correction, you, know what I'm you, you don't hit me. <laughs> you know my little brothers and everything. Like I said, we all got our own crews. We all got our own feelings. You know, everybody got their own emotions. You know, when you hear from black folks, you don't hear from the whole state. True. You know, True. if this so. ain't no, we gonna pick a you know, few people out of the, a one city or one suburb. It ain't. We coming all together. I'm known right. for coming a hundred or something strong. Yeah. Check my head, Google that, you know, so <laughs> come, you know, coming again, this time we're going to be on the full worker side, and we ain't coming and play no games, like, we're coming. So, I remember, I've been hearing, like, not too long ago, it was a King of the Circle in Minnesota, hosted by Tyson. I was wondering if you was there as such, you know, like, the King of Footwork up in Minnesota is, is um, DB, right, from Takeover Bangs. So, if, if that's what they want to say, you know, everybody got their opinion about things, you know. Yeah, it's like you be on everybody one coin, someone's the king here and there. Everybody, listen, Minnesota do not have a king or coin until we get our shit established. Uh, oh, no. By the way, Indiana don't have no king. <laughs> So there is no King Pac-Man, there is none of that. Oh. It's just Pac-Man. Hey, hey, Travis going to be on your... Hey, no, I'm just saying because I seen him on a couple of uh, comments on Wild Eye Cam, and he talking about some of the people in Indiana chosen to be a king. Did nobody choose him to be no king? Ain't no king to circle down there. We ain't had one. So he is known as Pac-Man. He is not king of nothing at all. And you know, the last came to Circle Hill was like 08, so it has been on yeah. KOTC since. But far as that, you know, the movie, everybody says they want to say, you know, I'm not here to knock nobody, you know, I'm here to, you know, support everybody. But it ain't, it ain't been no official king or queen in Circle in Minnesota. There have not been an official king or queen in Minnesota. We, the Minnesotans have not chose to do that just yet. Well, so, ask me this. Since there ain't really no official king, DB don't get offended because that's just people's opinions. But uh, I talked to I talked to my brother. They shout out to DB. He got shot, so he down. You know, pretty much for the summer. You know, they start hating out there in St. Paul. All y'all haters, you can't keep him down. You know what I'm saying? Damn, that's supposed to be the king. Hey, big up, DB man. Stay up. Keep kicking the leg, man. Fuck these yeah, niggas. He but he don't get mad. Like I, I tell him about this all the time. You know, like I say, we don't do the controversy thing. We pretty much talk to each other. We know how to call each other back in there. So somebody got a problem, feel like they, you know, somebody was saying something wrong. Look, we call. Them. Hey, bro. You know, we hand to hand like that. You know what I'm saying? We like to keep it like that. Yeah. We like to keep the beef within the with the dancing. You know, and not to take it like really too far. Too far. So, do you think one of these days, maybe in a year or two or a few, it'll be like a, a KOTC in Minnesota after everything gets established after? Oh, yeah. 2013, a year for all, all of that to happen. You know what I'm saying? For us to get you know, put on the map. We're the last state out here in you know, the Midwest really officially get put on with this shit, so. I, you know, I still don't get, coming. how the hell is Minnesota footwork, but ain't no Wisconsin footwork, and they two doors up from oh, us. They, they out there, like I say, you know, they, it ain't no teens out there, but they out there. You know, okay. You got people from Chicago, they out there in Wisconsin. Like sure. I say, shout out to Untouchables, they out there doing anything. Hey, to so all the footworkers worldwide, come to the motherland. 
if you want to learn real the, the foundation, oh. you got to come where it all started. You got to come. You got to come to the motherland. Japan too. Shout out to Japan food workers. I see y'all. You know. Hey, stop watching the witnesses shit. <laughs> <laughs> shout out to shout out to everybody out here that I can give respect to, you know, Habit, you know, Creation, Terror Squad, Tri oh yeah, I'm Tribe Minnesota too. A uh, Minnesota tribe. tribe representing, I can't yeah, forget. Yeah, we out here, you know what I'm saying, Tribe, you know, 187, all of them, we watch all y'all, you know, every day. You know, Fortune and Bangs, Crossfire, we, we read all your comments and everything, watch all your videos. Said, well, we ain't trying to come in here, you know, when we come and be for y'all on the dance till we want to have our own shit. Oh, yeah, Minnesota. I'm, I'll be up there. We trust I'll be up there. Well, yeah, we, I'll be up you know, there. We definitely watch it air move, so we ain't sleep at all. Well, hey, to Miss Minnesota, one of these days, I will be up there to record and interview y'all niggas, so come fuck with me. You know, I got mad love for Minnesota, nothing against y'all. Indiana, y'all is coming real soon. Shout out to Burn the Block. I wish all y'all crews would come here, so I guess motherfuckers. Yeah, once, I know right? we always come in separate portions. Never motherfucker, Lil Bam was lying his ass, I'm saying the whole crew is coming, I'm mad as hell. We was here yesterday, but it wasn't all of us, it was just the four originators that, was, that came yesterday. So yeah, man, so when you gonna get get chosen? No, let's come here, G. I want to see two footworkers from different states. We, we got. We actually hanging together, though. You we know, we all one together. the same. We're Chicago together. from Chicago to Indiana to Minnesota. I like this, you know. Burn the block, Minnesota tribe, you know. Hey, shout out to Reese, man. Shout out to Battleground. Shout out to Walla Cam. Everybody, Detroit, you know, East yeah. St. Louis, all y'all. Shout out. So yeah, man. How what's been going on with Band the Block? Y'all still the only group representing for Indiana Footwork still? Yeah, we're actually doing a party on the 23rd. We have a hub come down for hub people. We're gonna try to see if we can get some people from Chicago to come. It's one big party, just bring everybody together. Sure, how we get how we get, how we get down down there. It's gonna be by the beach, nice area, aqua touring. Yeah, cause you know, Indiana is one of the most low key footworks as well. You know, the only group that I knew back then was like Total Chaos, you know, shout outs to them, R.I.P. Yeah. Boutron. But, um, you know, you know, where y'all come from, you know, no man's land, shit look all dead as ever, but, you know, y'all trying to make a voice for yourself. A little bit. Yeah, trying to do that. Slowly but surely, it's gonna take some time. I respect that, I respect that. And you know, y'all doing the same thing. Y'all been around for some time, but y'all been super low key. I ain't heard none of y'all to like 09, 2010 for y'all. Uh, yeah, yeah. So my been telling me Minnesota for work been out since like 03. I'm like. 2000. Damn. 2000, we've been doing this since 2000. It's just, you know, a new. No new trend, yeah, yeah. I was old in with the new, you know what I'm saying? So when y'all trend went from, you know. Because, you know, everybody be telling me, like, they say YB started footwork, like, making more exposure out there, or they say you started it. Let me, let me, let me tell you something. You know what I'm saying? Files, like, the real footwork and combos, drops back then when the drops was out, the combinations, you know, basics. It was Magic Feet. You know, Magic Feet brought it to me. So, you know, DJ Sluggo and uh, DJ Boogie, they brung Juke to Minnesota, you know what I'm saying, in the late 90s, you know what I'm saying, Southside Clip. But real footworking, you know what I'm saying, that this new shit that, you know, they so-called doing, you know, they want to say they brung it, you know, they brung a new style to Minnesota, that's fine, you know, everybody got their own opinion, like I said. And what group was Magic Free from? Oh, Magic Free Minneapolis, this is my group, man. Oh, okay. Can I say something? Can I say something? I only want to say a couple of things. <laughs> I only want to say a couple of things. Just watch a witness. Yeah. Okay, y'all watching, y'all witnessing this shit. <laughs> hey, look, shout out to Eli, though, because didn't nobody know, like, my first, when I came to the first you know, queen of the circle out here, this man ain't know me from Adam and Eve. He was the only one showing me respect out of the whole building. He was the only one doing that shit, so shout out to you guys. Oh, this nigga getting emotional. Aww. Right. She come all the way out. <laughs> I didn't know the bully had feelings. You know what I'm saying? So. She come all the way out here from Minnesota and move them fucking feet. This nigga emotional. Don't cry. <laughs> Don't cry, nigga. Hold them tears, my nigga. <laughs> I feel your pain. It's deep, man. It's deep. <laughs> no, 
real shit. I just heard a nigga say, uh, <laughs> it be funny sometimes. This shit. I've been doing this shit for a long time, but I just heard a nigga say, you can win a battle without basics. That's a lie. Who Once said again, that? That's a lie. Fuck lie. That's a lie. Who said that? That's I ain't gonna put my Can you repeat that? Uh, <laughs> this nigga said, oh, I can win a battle without basics. You a fucking lie. <laughs> so I guess this is a low key diss to you because you hit a lot of bases and worse, nigga. Uh -huh. Hello, I'm doing this interview. I'm gonna call you right back, okay? That's right. how important it is. It's, 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 it, it, I'm gonna do bases. I could do big moves and shit, but that ain't my style. If I come out doing that shit, motherfucker gonna be like, damn, man, you know what I'm saying? Bases is what I do. That's how I got my name, Basics. You know what I'm saying? That's how I was taught Basics. So, you know what I'm saying? If you pay attention, stupid fuck. And you know when you see this, you know who the fuck I'm talking, you fucking stupid <laughs> ass boy. Listen, when you look at all the old school battles and all the old school kings of the circle like Ant Brown and all them and Cal Herd and all that type of shit going all the way back when I was like 10, 11 years old getting punched because I ain't out of footwork, you boy, listen. He ain't trying to say no names, ladies what? and gentlemen. What I'm trying to say, I'm trying, I'm trying to hope. <laughs> hey, he said you gotta smoke real quick. I'm trying to tell y'all. <laughs> Look, the police way back there. They, they mad as hell. This is the ultimate place. They, they mad as hell. Uh, but yeah, though, y'all gotta understand, man. Basis is the concept. Basis is the one that started the footwork game. Yo, Stupid motherfucker. So when you when you hit shit, when you hit shit different, it's just like, man, Joe. Okay, it was an add to to that. And then all the shit motherfuckers doing now, this shit been done, it just spiced up now. That's it. You stupid fuck. It's basic. <laughs> stupid motherfucker. Damn. True story. True story, Sasuke. Uh, he said. <laughs> so yeah, so who was your first teacher? Because I understand you was originally from Chicago, right? And then, yeah, I'm from here. I'm from here. then you travel to Minnesota. So who was your first teacher before you started do adding the trend of Minnesota along with DJ Sluggo? Uh, actually, I ain't had no teacher. You so know, you were self-made. Yeah. yeah, I just picked up from from different dudes. No shout out. Look, look, my favorite footwork team all times. I'm, I'm gonna keep it real. How somebody is y'all hot, but my favorite is Panic. You know, Put any nigga in check. Yeah, God I, damn. I, I'm just trying to keep it real. Like that's when I first like, you know, was like, okay, I want, I want to be serious with the footwork. You know. Well, believe it or not, that's where Havoc comes that's from. It. Yeah, yeah. You know, HOC. Shout out to HOC. You know, HOC too. Before creation. You know, like I was back, back then. You know, so I just watch all of them catch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Footwork and pick up a couple of moves. So I'm like, yeah. oh, I like that. Pretty much what I was just doing up in there. Like, oh, I, I like that. I gotta, I gotta mix that with my shit. You know? I ain't really have no teacher, you know. I grew up just doing that on my own, you know. So, you I can't know. say, but I get, I get shot to everybody that I took something from. You know? So, speaking of which, man, this is a personal question. Every motherfucker's talking about, oh, you biting my shit. Oh, woo, woo, and why are you hitting it this way? And how you, why are you hitting it my shit, woo, woo? But it's like, gee, how the hell can we know we hit your shit? We don't always watch YouTube. And even back then, how would you know? Shit. I think far as like with that, I like controversy with that shit is, is, is I think it's about who, who do that move the best. You know, Dang. who, who can do that combo the best, you know. It's just like hitting a routine when you got your crew out there doing a the routine, y'all all doing the same thing anyway. You know, y'all get pinpointed, you know, individually on who looks the best doing it, you know, doing it as well. So I ain't with that biting, because like, like my man say, all of y'all, you know, all this shit been around. Years, ever since yeah, it before me, I started in 07. Shit. Yeah, it just picked up and <laughs> speed it down. <laughs> Seven months ago. <laughs> shit, I started. Doing it for years. I started in 07, like shit. And that's when, that was when footwork was at its prime. Like everybody just danced so freely. Now it's to a point where you get so cautious being afraid like you hit a certain, a certain move you gonna be afraid of oh, something gonna pinpoint but it's like at the end of the day everything you hit youtube or not or on camera or whatever shit has already been done oh yeah That's like true. like there's a, everybody everybody fighting over moves and you know combos and everything else like I, i'm gonna keep it just like this you know everybody can say how they feel about me after watching this or whatever minnesota chicago wherever but like like i'm saying you know i'm a businesswoman at that 
You know why? Why everybody in the hood doing it every day, wishing to be somewhere else? I'm taking full work to, to the Target field. You know, Target corporate, Best Buy. I'm taking it to white people, Asians, Italians who ain't never heard of this no ever in life. I'm taking it to their presence, you know, and I'm showing it to them as well. I'm teaching kids who always wanted to learn this back then, you know. So I'm taking it to another level. You know what I'm saying? I'm respect. So you can sit here and be like, oh, she weak, or she can't beat this person, or she can't beat that person. You know, but I got the mayor, I got black leaders, leaders and everything else back there giving me respect off of something that you guys created right here in Chicago. I respect that. So, I respect that. That's, that's how we hey, Shout out to my man Nick for coming, man. This <laughs> man, he did, man. Boy, man. <laughs> he not even the a boy worker, Nick but he just man. came because I asked Straight from Indiana, man. Terry Tell, bottom side. You know who I fuck with, man. All the time. Yeah, Anything y'all both need to say, stand together so I can see y'all too. Anything y'all both got to say, you know, Indiana, Minnesota to Chicago. Anything y'all need to say? Look out. <laughs> Is it? I mean, because we got people like you've seen, you've never seen BTB up here with fully people. If we came with all our group, we need people that's way, way better than us that we just ain't brought. And they haven't made a chance to come out here. So, like, just watch out because there's going to be some low key talent coming out. Okay. You, you know. I'm just saying, Chicago, man, I'm just trying to win that queen of the circle. That's all. I hey. Stop, stop. Walla, holla at Walla. He does the kick. Walla, I can't. I already know that. I already done told Walla, like, what, two years ago? Look, I I'm dead serious. You know, a lot of people, I come up in here, you probably don't see me dance as much, you know, or don't get the chance to see, but I am really focused on, on that title. You know, I really want the Chicago title, Minnesota title, every title. Just you know, saying, so though, I like, I want to see her battle Diamond. The diamond that's in there right now. Uh, the no, 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 no. I'm gonna see about a crystal. I want to see. Oh, they I want see crystal. The crystal. I want you on crystal to battle. Man. That's gonna be beautiful. Shout out to crystal. You know what I'm saying? Anybody wanna see me and crystal battle? Hey, when you post this crossfire, you're gonna get like a hundred or some votes. I say 200 votes if you wanna see me and crystal battle. You yeah, know. 200 votes. I want to see Crystal and, uh, you know, Nana Battle. Yeah, I, Minnesota I, I, versus I come, Chicago. I come here, Minnesota Queen Vang. versus Chicago Queen. That's what we're going to call it. I'll, come, I'll bring Takeo Vangs with me. You know, a couple of people. You know, yeah. Tyson. You know, we uh, agree. You know, so to come down here. If y'all want to see, you know, so I'll battle whoever you want. But if you want to see me and Crystal, we'll get like 200, you know, votes. You know, we, we 200 that votes right. that let that happen. You know, so. Well, with that being said, I appreciate the interview and such. You know what I'm saying? You know, nigga from Burn the Block, Minnesota Tribe. Shout out to Q, man. He squad, Cookie, Trust. We out here. I am. Yeah. Well, I'm your host, Crossfire, for the night. Oh. All right, you know. good looking, man. All right, thanks a lot. You know what I'm saying?